With differing opinions on Robert Mugabe's legacy, people are being encouraged not to measure the former Zimbabwean president by only his last years in power. CGTN's Pariah Wakatuya reports from Harare. On Friday, Robert Mugabe was declared a national hero, a deserved honor for a leader whose shortcomings some are saying shouldn't overshadow his achievements. My appeal to you is have a balanced assessment of his contribution and of course also of the challenges of leadership which he had. But I think the president did a good thing to recognize that globally and as African, he is considered an hero. Tributes continue to pour in as Zimbabweans look back on his checkered and eventful 37-year rule. One of the most defining moments of Robert Mugabe's presidency was when he took over white-owned farms and redistributed the land to the black majority. It set him on a collision course with the West, but left an unforgettable legacy for beneficiaries. Since 2007, Nyaradzai Washaya has been rearing livestock and plans to expand into horticulture on the 117-hectare farm she was allocated in the Mashonaland Central Province. We will forever uh, remember him. And we are so grateful for our uh, grandfather, father, uh, for what he did for us. Um, if we look at it, uh, I, would, I wouldn't have I dreamed of getting such a piece of land. And uh, because of him, we, we were going to have any, any inheritance for our children and our grandchildren. Nothing can replace what he did, nothing. Washai intends to be among thousands of locals and foreigners who are expected to give the former leader a rousing farewell. The Mugabe we experienced uh, in the latter years of his life is, is different from the Mugabe uh, uh, whom Africa knows. In, in the rest of Africa, they totally respect Mugabe. They, they love his Pan-Africanism. They love the voice uh, he, he, kept, he kept on raising uh, at international fora. They love uh, the, the, uh, the, the power behind the person, the, the uh, 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 fight for Africa, the fight for an African to be recognized, the fight for Africa to have a seat in the United Nations. So how we view Mugabe and what he did for us in Zimbabwe and uh, uh, for us uh, as a country in the latter years of his life is totally different from how others perceive him. So yes, he will have a huge send-off. Mugabe is said to be buried at a shrine reserved for the country's liberation war heroes in Harare. No date has yet been set for the burial. Farai Mokutuya, CGTN, Harare, Zimbabwe.